What's up, YouTube? It's your man, Big Nord, back at it again. Oh, man, I got a feast before me, you know what I'm saying? You know, I got some quail up in here. You know, I got a nice salad equipped with the spinach, you know. Don't y'all see that there? Get a good look at that. time I um, click on the website, all they want to talk about is the um, scandal with a bunch of women in um, R. Kelly, you know, and you can't help but think, oh, I can't, you can't help but think, every few months, it's another black celebrity in trouble, you know, of women you know and it's like there's some sort of bias going on man because you look at our Kelly case all the women that came forward I didn't see not one white woman that's the thing I didn't see not one white woman came forward you know, and it seems like he's, he's escaping the trouble each time. You know? Um, I don't know what's going on. Uh, I know for a fact, Bill Cosby had a bunch of white women he was doing whatever with. And they came back 30 years later and it was like, you know, this guy He's a piece of trash. He's, you know what I'm saying? He did this. You know? But, well, who knows? For real. It's quite a lot. It's alright. It's alright. I didn't like no lamb chops, but, you know. It's alright. some of the salad in. I didn't use to put raisins in my salad until, you know, just recently. What's that thousand island? You know what I'm saying? Hey. What's that thousand island? I'm about to tear this up. It's just such a difference. I've been on water, I've been off water. All water is way better. You know what I'm saying? It's just not how you feel when you're drinking those, you know, sugary drinks. Because they're delicious, don't get me wrong, but like after you feel the, you know, replenishment from drinking water. It's a whole different ball game. You know? It comes a point where it's about your health, you know? Don't get me wrong. I would love to do mukbangs with McDonald's and, you know, all kind of things, you know what I'm saying? But I think about your health. 
And you know, healthy things are tasty too, you know? Mmm, especially when you put pepperoni in the salad. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's cheat code right there. <laughs> pepperoni in the salad. That's the cheat code. Mmm. Oh goodness. Mmm. -hmm. So good. Mmm, mmm. This salad just took over. Ah, damn. I forgot the camera was on for a minute. <laughs> damn, this shit is good. Damn. And it's in the news that former presidents are, you know, coming out, you know, disagreeing with, you know, Trump publicly. Which, I mean, they have a right to express their opinion. It's not a dictatorship, you know. But, but what y'all think? Y'all think they should do that kind of thing in closed doors? Or should they make that public how they feel? You know, because... Unless that they're supporting a particular candidate, why come out openly disagreeing, swaying public opinion? You know, because I guess there's still active Democrats or active Republicans, you know? They want that, um, they want that convention to be, you know, unified, you know, because it's coming up, you know? I want that convention to be unified. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That salad was a beast. Mm. Oh man. That salad was a beast. Oh my goodness. But hey. Yeah, so there you have it. I'm done. The quail, you know, it didn't take slice of KFC, but it was all right. You know, I tore that salad up. Raisins and pepperoni. Lord, man. I never heard that combination of salad. I just, I think I'm the only person who puts raisins and pepperoni in that salad. I might be wrong. Do you put raisins and pepperoni in your salad? Let me know in the comments below. Like and subscribe as well. Been getting this money since they was telling me to put on my ballys. Put my ballys on. From the top, I'm hardly gone.